been shot and very gravely wounded. The incident only happened within the last few hours. Indira Gandhi, ruler of the world's largest democracy, died today, shot down by two of her own bodyguards. quite a different type of politics than uh, one sees now because politics was not a career, it was being part of a movement. Maybe you're not. What would be the terms under which you would agree to be? No, it's not a question of terms. I don't want to be. You often but uh, in politics, you can't make a very categorical answer. I didn't want to be in Parliament, and I told everybody I wouldn't stand. But uh, here I am. W what do you think the Indian people saw in you? Did they feel that you had a particular sympathy for their cause? What made you the, the figure that you are in, in their eyes? It's what I've done for them. It's what they've seen that I've done. And yet they booted you out in 1977? Well, I think booted is a strong word. Uh, we were defeated, but within uh, less than a month after the defeat, they were coming back to me because there was such a, such a very sustained malicious propaganda that people were taken in by it. When people like your own parliamentary spokesman describe you as the woman to whom the gods have entrusted the destiny of India, what's your reaction? Well, I haven't even heard this phrase. I don't know who's used it. Do you, do you regard that kind of phrase as a meaningless extravagance? Yes, and we, we, in India, they, 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 most speeches are full of this thing. If you see the, uh, you know, the addresses that are presented to anybody, not me, anybody at all, you will be full of phrases like, phrases like this. Do you ever feel that you have in any way abused the trust that the that the Indian people have, have no, put in you? Certainly not. <laughs>